Uh, so again, we are Hyro and Mia. Um, and we focus, our project is based in Ciudad Bolívar, which is a settlement in Bogota, Colombia. Um, this settlement has about 2 million people and 20 or 20% of the population is um, under the power line under the power line and 7.4% is under the stream power line. So Bogota, Colombia has about uh, 7.3 million people and 40% uh, of uh, the population has informal jobs. So we, our project focuses on mobility um, to, um, in, the, in the research and the, the period of time that we have invested on this project, we went deep down on identifying and really understanding mobility uh, in Colombia and especially in Bogota uh, since the uh, settlements need to connect um, with the rest of the city. So the, uh, overall the, the system uh, or in, in a daily basis Bogota has about 15 million trips, daily trips and uh, it's broken down, uh, the BRT takes about 14%, the, uh, the SIP, which is the kind of regular bus, takes about uh, 24%, and then from then, um, private cars is 11%, and um, in contrast, 31% uh, of those trips are uh, in work. So, in addition to this kind of uh, X-ray of the of mobility of the, the, uh, the uh, income plays a huge role in, uh, in how people transport around the city. In the case of Ciudad Bolívar, um, in this, um, this slide we can see the, uh, the population density. So Ciudad Bolívar is around this area and uh, the population density, it, which is in dark, it shows like, you know, high, high density in that area. And uh, this area is where jobs are located. So people, uh, there's some trends on mobility patterns. People move, move from the outside of the city, again, she always right here, uh, in and out uh, during the day. So public transportation, um, the network that uh, in red is the BRT system. Uh, average station takes about 40,000 uh, trips a day. And, um, the time that people spend, or most people that live in this kind of the city, uh, which again we focus right here in Ciudad Bolivar, it takes the longest to commute back and forth. So, and this is like two lanes that go, uh, of the BRT that goes inside of Ciudad Bolivar, um, again, average um, bus station or BRT station takes about 40,000 people. So we went, we went and looked uh, into the map of how people uh, use these and what was the proximity uh, from the uh, BRT station to the rest of the neighborhood of the Ciudad Bolivar. We identified, like, so we divided in the, the uh, area that people will be willing to walk and the area that people will take uh, last, like the last mile transportation, which uh, is provided by an informal um, transportation, which is like a, a pedicab, and which focuses one of our ideas. And the rest that is sort of unknown, um, uh, there are other providers, but they're hard um, to identify. So um, we were in kind of a focus in two parts. One part is how do we connect the settlement to the rest of the city, and the other part is how does the city uh, mobilize within the uh, within the settlement. So we came up with this idea of a shuttle. The shuttle will take about uh, 36 people and um, and utilize, uh, so we managed to, uh, we in, in this concept we mapped some lanes uh, through uh, in, the, in the actual uh, map of found this uh, or made this map in Google Maps and traced uh, some lanes and some, some routes that will connect the shuttle to the uh, BRT. So the idea is that the BRT uh, or the, this shuttle will start off in one end of the settlement and start off picking, pick up people uh, 
uh, throughout until it hits the BRT, which is in a designated lane, and from there it will take all the way to downtown, which are the majority of the jobs. The system that we, or this idea that we came up with, we pretty much in, the, in Google Maps measure from one lane to another and uh, calculate based mis on assumptions on what people will uh, walk and what will be kind of a, an ideal service. And we made 12 rounds, or uh, that in these 12 rounds will be um, leaving and taking out every uh, five minutes and um, ending in a um, uh, Pretty much giving this um, the capacity of 72,000 people uh, daily riders. So again, the system will um, go throughout the settlement, and once it hits the BRT, it will go into the designated lane, uh, making it you know, a pretty kind of a fast uh, shuttle all the way downtown. Um, yeah, it's going to come out. And also, uh, in the community sphere, we also just uh, propose an idea to implement powered vehicles. So, because the pagoda in the local pagoda of the Zilogliba is kind of the, uh, they have a great resource of the bicycle inductions. So, basically, we just took uh, just kind of a simple structures and uh, who, who can, uh, who we can just provide an open, open platform so they can just get a blueprint and then uh, assemble a car and in the uh, local factories. And uh, here is kind of uh, the origin era is kind of our just uh, focus uh, village, the Sila Oliva. But we are kind of to give a big image of the whole, uh, how the whole just the Bogotas works. And the <coughs> region is kind of the most uh, density era. So we wanted to just provide a service as uh, first step in these regions. And uh, of course, uh, it's also can uh, just get a benefit from our shared ride system, and uh, they can just uh, give more drive in the local, uh, local, uh, the local community. And uh, with, within the system, they can just get a local workshop, and uh, we just uh, use uh, the re, uh, rechange and uh, the change uh, battery system, and help us to work uh, uh, this system in the communities. And and we, we wanted to do some kind of simulation, so we uh, pick up this area particularly, and we set up uh, all the tools for uh, uh, the simulation and uh, some and uh, from uh, by the bus and by the bicycle, and uh, the last one's by the uh, walk. So once uh, I get the uh, starting point and destination, this can uh, generate uh, the times and the. Uh, reasonable uh, uh, ride for the uh, road. So here's uh, uh, how we work. So first, we just pick up the uh, we, we pick up a, a hundred starting point in the list regions, <coughs> and we start, uh, started to calculate the time consuming and also the uh, reasonable road. So th this area is kind of the area we just focus on. So we really just pick up the 100 points, and uh, 100 starting points, and uh, to generate the, uh, the road uh, and the time. And basically, they will just kind of uh, find a uh, uh, close uh, big station along the line. And finally, it's just kind of a combination for the 100th road. And second step, because uh, uh, we are just mentioned, so we are just kind, uh, kind of combined two uh, systems. So first one is kind of BRT system in the main street in the Bogotas, and uh, another one is uh, is kind of the uh, bicycle systems. Then we also kind of uh, insert concept is that uh, the shuttle can just get into a village. So uh, how we kind of are trying to find the uh, the, the sub the sub stations of the village. So based on the, the previous trends we just find it in the Hundreds Road, so we are kind of just find the uh, uh, pick up the night uh, substation in the village. So we, so we just uh, adjust the boundary and the, the range of the uh, substation service. So finally, we can just <coughs> so time consuming will change at the same time. So finally, we can just get a result of this one. So 
this kind of the radius is just stayed stayed in the 700s, uh, uh, 687 meters. It's uh, kind of a great solution for our systems. So, which means a uh, hundred uh, starting point to a hundred uh, end points can can just uh, spend a mass of points. And this kind of uh, and uh, this range is kind of uh, the biggest range of this. Uh, <coughs> Radius is 5.9 5 minutes to 6.9 minutes, which means uh, 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 wherever just call a uh, bike in listed regions, so the uh, waiting time will not uh, more than uh, 10 minutes. And the last one is kind of uh, we just uh, we calculate and all the systems use the same uh, starting point and the same destinations. So finally, we can kind of generate another. Uh, wrote for our simulations. So uh, this is kind of a step we just put in the substation in our village. So it's kind of uh, to change the the roads uh, from the original ones to the final ones. Uh, so. Finally, we we're kind of so the first simulation, uh, first simulation, we just use the, our uh, original system. So the uh, last simulation, we just uh, go into our the system we just provided. So finally, we just compare, we just choose a list of the uh, hundreds uh, destination and uh, hundred starting points destination, and in average, it will just save uh, forty five percent of the times. So this is kind of uh, our simulation before and afters. <coughs> 